Okay, my prototype has made it to the transport. We should be good to go. Strike team, there's a helo inbound to pick you up. Soap's got the 411 on mission parameters. Follow his lead.
I know you can hear me. You should know. I've offered a bonus to anyone who brings me one of you alive. Hot shot. Drone deploying flare above DZ. Area is clear. For now. Get there before Terminus does. Shit! Prototype is in your airspace. Arrival imminent. She's heavier than she looks. It took three of us to strap her to the ATV. Sentry gun deployed.
Package is on site. ACV's done her thing. Now it's down to you. Switch on the Ethereum neutralizer's power supply. the test was a success. The ether neutralizer destabilizes any ethereum within its blast radius. What remains of the element rapidly decays into harmless isotopes. But that was raw, unprocessed ethereum. The material in Zakayev's vial is highly enriched. My projections show this weapons-grade ethereum can withstand our prototype. In other words, you failed. This was a waste of time and resources. Not true. The principle has been proven. We just need to amplify the neutralizer and recalibrate its output. And you can do that, can you? Not quite. But Zakayev obtained research written by the expert on Ethereum enrichment. Strauss. Old mayor yours? Friends are a luxury I can seldom afford. Zakayev stored Strauss's research in a vault. It'll be heavily guarded, but that research holds the key to upgrading the neutralizer. We don't have time for this. Our focus should be Zakayev himself. And if we find him, then what? He unleashes his remaining vial, and we have nothing to counter it. Deadbolt might be able to hammer this thing hard enough to contain it. But if the objective is to end it, that neutralizes our best shot. Fine. Get Strauss's data. See what Dr. Jansen can do with it. 